4.37 to go first quarter. Here's Martinez back to pass. Going to get flushed out. Deep behind the line of scrimmage. Rolls right, throws into the end zone. He's got a man open and the catch is going to be made. And that is Velazquez hauling in the ball. And that makes it a 15-yard touchdown pass officially, even though Martinez had to throw the ball close to 30 yards. Boy, they had that quarterback on the run. Once again from the I formation, J.C. Robles throws it out into the flat. Flat. He's got Chapansky, who's got a first down and more, eludes the defender. He's down well inside Rams territory. And Alex Chapansky gets into pay dirt once again. 75 yards, first offensive play, fourth time around. What a great play by Shapansky, his second touchdown of the night. Just under three minutes to play in the second quarter. Receiver in motion is Brinson. Here's the blitz. And they set Replay. up the screen. Not gonna work. A good well. play. Initially, whoa, he breaks free. How did he do that? The whistle never blew, and it's going to be a touchdown for Ali. Mike, give him six. Last week, my jinxes were reversed. I would say bye bye, or he's gone, and every time he'd get tackled. This time, I said it's not going to work, and guess what? Give him six. A 33 yard touchdown run on a fourth and nine early on in the first quarter. A double reverse, back to Bodden. Trickery out of the bag early for Los Gatos. Olivet wide open, caught. 10, five, touchdown, Wildcats. Holy cow. That was an incredible play. They handed it off to Ryan Galt, and then the ball eventually got back to Bodden, and he threw a bit of a duck down there. I'm not gonna lie, it wasn't a tight spiral like they probably drew it up, but the fact is, is it got to Corey Olivet, and, uh, and the rest is history. What a play. Right here, tie ball game with this running game. You expect a little bit of conservative calls, I think. Here's the sweep, little speed sweep with room near side. That's cross. He's gone. He is gone, oh, my folks. Goodness. And Pick a Yoon has taken the lead. Are you kidding me? How is that, that supposed to happen? Oh, my goodness. 75 yard run by Cardarius Cross. Here he comes, give him around the outside and watch his speed to get there. Give it to him, follow the block. He gets to the outside and just outruns the defensive secondary. That's the first time we've seen that call all night. That's the first time that Oxford has seen it run at them. And boy, was it a great play call at a great time. The fans feeling it inside Tucker Stadium. 8.56 remaining in this fourth quarter. Third down and 10 for the MUS Owls. Blake Bennett, the senior quarterback. Rolls to the outside, throws into coverage. Interception number three. Donovan Sheffield returns it for six more. And the Innsworth Tigers, what? A swing in this ball game in this fourth quarter. 32 yards on the return as Blake Bennett has thrown back to back to back interceptions. Again, off balance, thrown against the body. It's Donovan Sheffield, the Vanderbilt commitment. And watch Sheffield's speed right here. Once he gets the ball in his hands, he's gone. No offensive lineman's going to catch Donovan Sheffield as he returns it for the Innsworth touchdown. Force Kyle Olinchuk, the sophomore, into the starting role at center. The younger brother of the quarterback, Derek Olinchuk. This ball is batted and intercepted at the 30, at the 40. He could go at the 45, 40, 30. Staying in bounds at the 20, the 10, 5. Touchdown for Demarcus Harris, the 5'11", 230-pound junior. Defensive tackle goes the distance. What a play right there. That was the great break that something needed down two scores. And it was a design screen play. They allow Harris in, the, the senior. He bats it himself and catches it. And right there, you thought the piano was going to get on his back right there. He's getting a little tired, boss. Romero Rock puts his arm around him and kind of runs beside him. That's just a good job of dexterity by a defensive lineman. They're not known for having great hands. And he watched that ball in with great focus, got down the sideline, and 
strike up the band for Sumter High School. 25 yard line. And they're going up top looking for the quick strike. What a catch! Arian Hayes lays out and a fabulous reception for another Dylan touchdown. What a beautiful grab on a diving effort by Arian Hayes. Bobbled it just for a second, but I don't think there's any question. He had full possession as he came down to the ground with that. What a play, what a catch. Arian Hayes. That's what I saw. From the Tigers, 25 yard line. Here it is, Watson. Three receivers, there's one receiver not covered. Tucker looks like he's coming on the blitz. Kirk Tucker, all right, here comes Tucker off that edge. Here's Watson, has time, has a receiver, and what a catch for the touchdown. A one-handed diving catch made by Gainesville and an incredible play by Jay Godlock. Watson in the face of some heat throws up a dime and Godlock, unbelievable catch, wide open in the corner of the end zone. Mason Rudolph has connected on all of his passes so far. Three for three. There's his fourth throw. He's going to fire for the end zone. Has a man. Is that an amazing one-handed catch? It is. Touchdown. How about that? Dupree Hart in the end zone. One-handed over the shoulder. How do you do, Mr. Dupree? One-handed. This is talent, though, Birch. You can't coach that. Nice touch by Mason Rudolph, but he threw it ahead, so only Dupree Hart had a chance at it, and that's just great talent right there. That's God-given. Going up with the right hand right here, pretty well covered. Had a man running step for step with him. And as he crosses the goal line, he pulls it in.